Oh, you little nutcracker. Yeah, yes! I don't know what happened, but now it's working. The motor has res magically restarted this morning. And as you can see, the bubbles are coming into the pool. So we're gonna go, I guess, get the tools in order to clean the pool, get the chlorides. Uh, and we're gonna try to get it restarted. Uh, a friend of my dad told me that it's not very good to put another shock treatment into your pool. We already did one and it went back to green a little bit. So what they suggested to me is to put two cups of chloride in there and hopefully it'll go back to normal. Now we have one more problem and I can't figure out what, what the solution is, but I put a little tape over there because I feel like the pool is losing water and I don't know from where. I don't think it's the pipe. I think it's from somewhere else. See, yeah. so there's all of this now water. So I'm thinking it might be leaking from somewhere else. But how could that be? Because there's a brand new liner. The brand new liner, but it might be leaking inside here. That's the only thing that I could see. It could be leaking inside here somewhere. Well, that's better than a big pipe at the bottom. It could the also be the pipe. I don't know. I really don't know what it is. Why don't we turn off both and see if it leaks? That's Maybe. what I did last night, baby. Last night I closed them both. I woke up this morning and there's just water. Hmm. Or, I have a question though. When you say you turn it off, does that mean you close the exits the of? But you close it, the motor. Yeah, but there's no water in a pipe. You know what I mean, like. So that's what I'm saying. It must be leaking from somewhere else. Hmm. Where I don't know. Today let's do it. Let's let's add water, chloride, and let's monitor the level of the water over the next few days. Could it be evaporation? I don't think it could evaporate that overnight. I mean, could be. I don't know. Okay, look, I'm gonna let it go. Hopefully it's not a pipe on the ground. Hopefully it's just something easier to fix, uh, but we'll see in the future time. For now, let's just stick to today. We're gonna get the chloride, get the thing fixed, and we're gonna still work on the backyard. Yeah, look, the weeds are already coming up, so that's what it is. We gotta yep. get all the weeds out. And we'll see you back a little bit after. So we're at the pool store. We're gonna buy the chloride, buy a bit of little scooper thingy. And Grace was researching about the pool situation. It might be the skimmer as well. They said that it could be the skimmer. We're gonna put some red dye in the skimmer. It's gonna bring the red dye towards the hole where it's leaking. So we might be able to find it that way. Uh, that's a good solution. It's a good technique, good trick. So we're gonna try it out. Otherwise, it might be something else as well. We'll see. I come and go like a rock. All these friends got me trimming a knife. Always on some new thing like riding the bike. Let's do things. All right, guys, so we settled down for the uh, recommendation that they had here. So we're going to put a Trademan Super Shock, whatever it's called, into the pool at night. And then tomorrow our pool should go back to normal, which we're going to start seeing the blue color from our pool. Then we're going to move to the next step and try to figure out what's the problem with the leaking because we don't really know what it is. So we're going to get some food, we're going to eat, and then we're going to start cleaning the pool. We're here in line, guys, because I'm waiting for uh, Wendy's burger. We're eating burger again, I know. But I started running. I'm at four kilometers. I'm doing very well. So I'm going to treat myself with a burger and I'm lazy today. But I was thinking there is a Buffett place that opened last year. When they opened, it was madness, guys. There was 600 seats in there, always packed all the time. Uh, restaurants around the area started closing because they were taking everything. The parking lot was always full. It was it was pure madness here and then it went from this to now there is no one no one going there because it's a buffet and it's not even reopened and they might never reopen again because it's a weird thing they're gonna have to serve people at the table here if you go to the buffet here they're gonna have to serve you at the table which also doesn't make much sense because usually you don't go to the buffet for the quality of their food you go there because you can serve yourself and take a lot of food right i was thinking like sometimes in life you got stuff like this where like you're like living the dream and it just turned into nightmare out of nowhere we're kind of lucky after all we're not it's not as i'm very sad for those people because they had the dream it was working very well and this thing came out of nowhere so there's always somebody who has it worse than you in life and i was just sitting here watching it and i was like it must really be horrible for them right now to have that feeling that went through so high and now having to close and might never reopen back again after probably million of dollar investment in that thing it's huge so anyhow we're, we're waiting in line because that's a new normal 
we're uh, lining up. We're not the only one. There's like a lot of them behind us too. Uh, Grace says she's getting chicken burger. I am. I'm getting a chicken burger. I think it was good. Yeah. I'm going to get a burger and I have a trick to give you. I've learned that a long time ago. If you go to McDonald's, if you go to Wendy's, don't take the pops, the soda. Don't take the fries. Just take the burger. You're never going to get fat. Burger is fine. If you take the fries and the soda, this is where trouble starts. Sometimes I take two burger, but I don't take the fries. Don't take the Sprite. JD was asking like, why am I in a bad mood? I'm like, sometimes I'm in a bad mood. I don't even know why I'm in a bad mood. But I was like thinking about it. I'm like, okay, let me step back. Let me just think. Why am I in a bad mood? And I figured it out. It was like, well, the restaurants are reopening Monday. Yeah, I'm getting feeling a little anxious about that for sure. You know, What's like, making you nervous though? It's like my, like, you know, like things have happened. I've made some changes to our business and I'm like, oh, is that the right decision? And I, I hate that I don't really know. Like for instance, I took away cash. We're cashless now. It makes my life so much easier operating a business where we don't have to count cash, which is like dirty dirty and also takes time but it's like yeah but we're in a, we're right now we have to try stuff because we're in a survival mode seriously and now it's yeah. time to try things they might work they might not work you know you might you might be very surprised that that's the best decision you ever made after the fact sometimes you, know? you don't make this decision because you're afraid and you make this i mean right now we have nothing to lose to be honest yeah so it's like can we go ca can we be cashless there's just like a lot of like whatever like we're going we're, we're opening again we're opening it's like do i need to have more people working on that first day that we open or do i stick with my things so jd asked me why am i in a bad mood I think it, that's why I'm in a bad mood. I mean, it's not, it's not that it's really unusual anyway. <laughs> yeah. Isn't she beautiful? Stress, dude. It's stress. <laughs> All right. No, I'm in good mood now because I'm eating Wendy's. I'm going to go have like my chicken burger. So I'm in a happy, happy place. Everybody says Disney. <laughs> They're wrong. It's Wendy's. It's Wendy's. If you haven't seen her Disney on the video, now it's time. It, it's a little bit longer. But if you haven't been to Disney before, and if you are new to us, uh, to our channel, go see our Disneyland video after that one because it's a good one. I liked it. I enjoy it. I watch it often and I really enjoy it. So you might enjoy it too. All right. If you're new here right away, just subscribe down below. Kiss, you know, press the thumbs up button too. It always helps. Bye. <laughs> I'm coming back with this money in the bag. All right, so I got my food. Almost got a second burger bite. Just hold my temptation. I hold it. I got strength. I got power. I got willingness. How do you call that? Anyway, <laughs> we have all the synonyms around it, so you figure it out. You happy? Yes, I'm so happy. I you have a face of this. a really happy person right now. I am. <laughs> so there's only burger in there. There's no fries, no soda, right? The kids would be kind of mad, but whatever. Why would they be mad? Well, because they always want their fries and sodas, but it's not good for you. We just need well, the burger. Well, they had soda last night anyway, so it's not a big deal. Yeah. All you ever did was run your mouth. Yeah, we at the spot. They be stunning now. They don't see the bigger picture. We be cutting now. All I'm saying is... Guys, I had an appointment at the park at 2 p.m. with a friends of Gabby because his dad contacted me. He says his son wants to play with Gab at the park. We went to buy the stuff. I totally forgot the appointment. I forgot my phone at home because the kids were using it. So now we're late for the appointment. I'm so sorry. I really, really, really forgot. Grace just reminded me. All right, guys, I'm going to head out. I'm going to head to the park with Gabby. I'm going to pick him up. We're going to head to the park. We're going to eat our burger at the park. Yeah. You're supposed to go see Curtis 30 minutes ago. Where's my phone? Did nobody text on my phone? Yeah, it was Curtis' dad. How come you didn't text Mama to tell her? Because he just texted. I'm gonna go let myself. I'm supposed to meet them at the park at 2 p.m. Us all? Why me too? You don't have to come. All right, let's go, guys. We're gonna eat the food at the park. Okay, get ready. Let's go. Let's go, Gab. What happened to your hamburger? Just all right, guys. So we're in the car. The Packer have their burger. <laughs> I, I, I think you're doing it. Yeah, Put your seatbelt and we can go. Then we can, okay. All right, let's go. Five minutes later. Remember I said the other day we didn't want to invite people to play with our kids because we weren't sure like who wanted them or not. So one of the parents reached to me and said, my son would like to play with your kids. We're starting to have them socialize again. So I said, yeah, absolutely. So now they're at the park today and they're going to play together. Unfortunately, I went to get the stuff for the pool and I totally forgot, but they were nice enough to wait here. So, yeah. Who's that? It's Maxim and he's coming to the park right now. Oh my god, it'll be a big party at the park today. More people are joining at the park. Party is on, Mim is coming. I don't know if we're gonna do the pool because as you can see, this house is really dark. It was actually raining a little bit earlier, so. Well, you guys are too high. Oh, oh that's small one there. She can climb. Too fast. Don't push me. Don't push me, Dad. No. Let me go. Wait. Wait. I don't think I'll ever catch him. 
Whoa! You guys are too fast. Can I give up? I'm done. It's gosh time. Come on, you little nutcracker. Yeah! Yes! Ow. Woo! Yes! Still got it. Still got it. Oh, it's warm. Now you're the tag. Good luck. I'm retired. I don't play that anymore. This is the first time we come to the park since the beginning of the quarantine. They haven't seen any friends since March. So they've been playing here for three hours now. I'm burning under the sun. I'm extremely thirsty, but they won't go home. I can't stop them. It's the first time. It's like, it's pretty obvious that they really, really, really missed it. So I'm very happy to see them play like this nonstop. It's very cool. But I think we're going to have to head home eventually because the sun came out and I'm, I'm cooking under the sun here right now. How is it in the place where you live right now in your case? Is the kids play in the park like this? Are they reacquainted with their old friend that they haven't seen in a long time? Or In our case, I mean, some of them have grown by a feet right now. It's crazy. In three months, they've grown so fast. All right, so we're going to go home and then Gab is going to receive a signal from his friend to go play laser tag at the park again tonight at 8 o'clock. What a crazy day, right guys? Yep. Yeah. All right. So now we have to get some food for the week. Get some food, get the pool, and back to the park for playing later. It's getting complicated because I got late with all this this park me first meeting thing. So I got late with the first part with the park meeting. So I haven't had time to do it. So I'm, I'm not going to do it today. I'm going to do it tomorrow. Unfortunately, I'm just going to leave it like this to see if the water leaked during the night. So tomorrow I have a better idea if it's leaking anywhere. And then tomorrow morning, I'm going to clean the pool, remove all the leaf at the bottom, do the shock tomorrow night, then restart the filters. This is what's gonna be the plan. So tonight we're just gonna go to the park. Uh, I'm gonna forget that for tonight. Let's go to the park, let's go play. 8.01 p.m. Gab! What? What's happening, where are you going? Going to the park, it's eight o'clock. It's eight o'clock already? Eight o'clock actually, I'm late. You're late, so you're going to the park and I'll meet you there? Yep. Are you gonna go too? Yeah. I'll go with you. I got that guy there. How close do you guys think we can get from him? I see your tail. I see your tail, bro. Get out of there. You're crazy. Have a good day, Mr. Marmot. All right, so we're at the park. The team's already there. I can see them right here. So let's go see what they're doing. Go get the crew. Now I want to go on top of the hill and then roll down. Okay, do that. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> a lot of fun. Charlotte marches to our home drum beats. She does whatever she wants, so. All right, the boys are here. I don't see, oh, I think they're getting gear up right now. They're putting the guns on, the tags and everything. Oh, no, so you get all the guns and everything? Yeah. What? When is it starting? I don't know. As soon as up. It seems like there's too many members for the amount of gun, but I guess they'll figure it out, right? Yeah, they'll figure it out. Mom okay, is trying is... to untangle that thing because oh, I think it's like this one. Like something went wrong and now nobody can put them on because they're all untangled. Oh. Oh. I, I think it's just made worse. Okay, got it. Because I know how to put it on. It's just that I don't know how to untangle it. So. Okay, it's good. Awesome. Yeah. Let's be blue. Let's be blue. No, you're it, gonna it be with Max. It doesn't look blue at all. I wanna be with Gabe. No, come on. No, okay. Press the button here, she and then she. But that's what I'm doing. Go. Go. Oh really, huh? God, Max. I'm trying to charge it. I guess laser tag was not a hit. <laughs> Are you guys having issues with your thing? I don't know. Mine has issues. It's like mental problems. You know what's important? You know what's important, like guys? This? It's I'm to hot. be together. So you guys can just pretend that these gonna work and My just dudes. run all over the no, place. No, but it's more fun if it does work. You I know, suck. but just do. Pew, 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 pew. Anyway, you. <laughs> anyway, you. <laughs> anyway, you have to. <laughs> I think they should get to paintball. That's much more interesting, isn't it? 
all right guys it doesn't seem to be working really well right now they've been talking for like about 15 minutes about how to recharge the gun how to set up the gun how to plug the gun and the gun don't recharge don't plug it doesn't really work well just so pretend. far <laughs> but they're having fun together and that's what matters right and i think it's just so cute that they made a, an appointment yeah, an appointment a little meetup yeah today and then everyone showed up so that, i think that's super yeah. cute yeah all right we'll let them play a little bit and then uh guys thanks for following us thanks for subscribing if you're first time here subscribe down below stay safe stay positive and never give up